I want to talk about uh, the biggest news. You're engaged. I am. This is fantastic. Uh, hey, congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. Yes, uh, John Stamos and I finally decided. <laughs> Wow, finally. And he's oh. so handsome. He's going to grow the mullet back to he me. He is a good-looking uh, dude, man. I met a woman, and, uh, and, and, and it's great. And she's, she's younger than me, which I know is shocking, but um, <laughs> she's beautiful. She's wonderful. Yeah. And, and you, you have love. You have beautiful I love. I do have love, yeah. Did you, I mean, how was the proposal? What did you do? Well, I, special? I, I don't think I did it perfectly, because I am, uh, uh, you know, I'm half her. You're supposed to do half your age plus seven in L.A. and New York. That is the legal <laughs> showbiz. <laughs> That is not an equation that anyone knows. It's in the law books. <laughs> in the Beverly Hills court. Yeah. But, uh, I, we were watching, we were up in Big Sur, and uh, I had, had the ring in the safe, and we were watching Stranger Things on the iPad, and I paused it, and I don't think I did things right, and I got So far, it's going great. Yeah, I think <laughs> I mean, it sounds yeah. romantic. What's more romantic than Stranger Things? Yeah. So we're in the upside down, and so... <laughs> Well, that was right before. But anyway, so, uh, sorry, sorry. Peace, love. So, so wait, wait, sorry. Peace and love, no, and sorry. Understanding. Yeah. So, yeah. so I, I got on one knee, and I, I didn't phrase it right. I said, I, I would like to be with you for whatever days I have left. <laughs> it's morbid. I didn't that mean is, I didn't, That is morbid. That is didn't so... sound good. No. And she said, would you please rephrase that? And I... <laughs> And I said, yes, I want to spend our lives together, and I love you, and all that, all that. I was just talking to you separately, saying Oh, I love sorry. You. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. Well, I was... How is the, uh, how is the family, how are the daughters? They, they're probably grown up out they're of the house. They're old. They're 95, 82. Wow. They're really old. Beautiful. Um, <laughs> oh, my God. I have, I have, uh, you I have know two, you love... right? I have two little girls, yeah. Mm. And I, I have three big girls, but they're still my babies. They're, they're 31, 28, and 25. They're here in New York? Uh, two are, and one's uh, in the West Coast, and... They're all artists. They're all incredibly talented wow. at art, all different kinds of art. My, hey, that's great. My middle daughter just uh, chose a, a new medium. And so she calls me up and says, I'm working in a new art medium. And I said, what, what is it? And she says, I, I blow glass. And I said, I'm a comedian. You have to change vocations. <laughs> I, I, okay, yeah. I literally said that. <laughs> and that was a big word for me, vocation. Yeah, I know. And then I told her last night that I was going to mention that on the air. So uh, I'm sorry, Lara. <laughs> You're I'm just really doing what I never mentioned my kids' names, you, but I you, feel bad. No, she said, don't do, don't do that, Dad. No, you have to. That's what a dad's job is. You have to embarrass your kids. Uh, <laughs> Fuller House, congratulations on this. It's right. coming up for a fourth season. Yeah. Dude, Fuller House! It will, never, it will never go away. I know, I mean, uh, did you ever think that that would happen? You come back Stamos and Stamos you... did. I, I did not. And, that is and great. It, it's going to last. My joke is, which is in my special, but we'll get to that. Um, the joke is, one day it'll be Fullest House, it'll just be me in an urn by the window. That will be <laughs> Just, uh, I think I've overdone it's that. It's great. Joke. No, it's great. It's fantastic. It is. The kids can watch it. I like being able to do stuff that goes off the rails and also do stuff that's for family. So well, you can doing, sit down yeah. and watch stuff with your kids. Oh, and then you're directing uh, this movie. You directed a film. How do you have time to do all this stuff? I did. Well, we made six months, seven years. I tried to get it made. And it's called Benjamin, and it comes out in the fall. And I had a wonderful cast. And it's, it's about something that means a lot to me. Uh, it's about a 15-year-old boy that we believe is on drugs. And so it's, it's, but it's dealt with as a dark comedy. And so you find out what I think is important, the reason I wanted to make it is that the parents, the adults are, we got to examine ourselves to help these 15 year old kids that are out there that yeah. are growing up in this crazy world that we're in. Yeah, exactly. So, yeah, think about that. That's uh, supposed to get, it's getting applause in my head. <laughs> that was, that's good. I bet I meant it. Uh, Let's talk about this. Are you so psyched you have a comedy record? It's, uh, I, it's, I, I it's love, on vinyl. I love vinyl, dude. Vinyl I, is... I want to come out on, on floppy, and I want to come out on <laughs> CD-ROM. CD-ROM, yeah. Eight track Well, hopefully, yeah, if it does well, it'll oh, come out on CD-ROM. God yeah. willing. Uh, Let's well, like set in my future. I know that, obviously, I know you for a long time, and we're yes. just fans. I mean, you uh, put me on the phone with Rodney. I'll never forget that. Yeah. Uh, Rodney Dangerfield, and it's just, I mean, but that, now you have a record. I mean, you're on the, you're on the, you're in my collection, and you're in a lot of people's I'm, collection. I'm but, thrilled, but and, I mean, and, and it's been doing really well. People are, because I just, I do what you want to do, which is entertain people, especially during this crazy world we're in. But this yeah. thing, it's on uh, Amazon Prime, so you can buy groceries while you're watching it. It's, <laughs> That's not what it does. No, no, oh, that's not what it is. <laughs> no, but, but this thing is uh, the fact that they made a uh, vinyl out of it. I didn't know like, that you uh, uh, play guitar and sing. Since the beginning, since I was 17 years old, I'd seen Martin Mull doing comedy songs, oh, and then I, I, I love Martin. I love. Mull. I'm working on a documentary about him, directing oh, really? it. Yeah. Anyway, 
it, comedy music. There's four songs on this uh, special, and the last one is called We've Got to Be Kind to Each Other. So that's kind of my give peace a chance, and it involves stuff below my waist as well, so everybody's happy. Uh, you know what I like about uh, one of the uh, uh, tracks here? Someone from the crowd just yells out, uh, We need you, Bob! And you go, As long as you need me, I'll be there for you. That's pretty cool, man. I know that wasn't written, but... I love you, buddy. Bob Saget, everybody. Check out his comedy special, Zero to 60, on Amazon Prime Video.